Hello, in this quick demonstration we're going to take a look at how quickly we can duplicate geometry and edit the geometry by directly interacting with this wheel model. The first thing I'm going to do is add more occurrences of that top slot. I'm going to do that by applying a circular pattern. All I need is a center point of that pattern. Here I've created four occurrences for that particular pattern. If I need to make a change, I can quickly grab the handle and change it to how many occurrences I want for that slot. The other thing you'll notice is I can directly come in here to any face on any of the occurrences and make changes. It does not have to be the master feature of the pattern, so to speak. If I come down here to another occurrence, grab another face, you'll see that I can make that change and all the occurrences of the pattern update. Maybe another thing I need to do to this specific pattern is to make it a more aesthetic. I can rotate that face out. And once again, notice how all the occurrences are updating. I can also directly dimension to the model faces. So if I come in here and apply an intelligent dimension, you'll see that I can drive the shape of that with a specific value. Maybe I want to make changes to this inside bolt hole circle, this hole pattern. I can come in here and just grab a face and change the diameter on any occurrence. Also, I can come up here and select this particular occurrence and any existing dimensions I may have or any dimensions that I may want to add, as we did earlier, I can go ahead and drive that value as well. The final thing we want to do to the model is notice just by selecting that top tapered face, I get a nice little edit handle that I can drive the angle of that face. So maybe I want that to be specifically 50 degrees. So here you see how quickly we could duplicate and edit the geometry by directly interacting with the model.